Alrighty, PG-13. This is G.I. Joe, 1990. Hello, do you want to play a game? Let's play a game. Saw Fiber. You all have to guess. There is only 30 figures for this year. <laughs> There's 30 figures for this year. I have 22, I'm missing 8, and we'll go through it, but first, we'll have a look at the figures. This one here is Ambush, look at that, Ambush got some nice mustache handles, <laughs> now he deserves one of them races back helmets. <laughs> This is guy's like all about rock and roll, country music, so he ain't no racist. <laughs> we just like to have fun with that. Alrighty. Then we have Sub Zero. <laughs> Not the uh, Mortal Kombat Sub Zero, but we do have Sub Zero. What, what are the? What's the next temp one going to be? Temperature? <laughs> Freezing gauge? <laughs> Then we have Blowhorn. I don't have his awesome helmet, but I just painted this helmet and threw it on him. Looks pretty cool. Blow, Blowhorn. It's almost like a spirit's replacement. But, hmm. Blowhorn. Then we have Rampart. He looks pretty awesome. I think yeah, he has a missile that goes on here. Not sure if I have all his weapons or not. Some of the figures I may or may not have the weapons for. Then we have Pathfinder, and there is other versions of Pathfinder. There's a gray one for sure, because I have that one. I had three, but I, you know, switched them around for parts. <laughs> he looks pretty cool, but I do don't like the how they do that on the waist. You know, I wish they would have had a separate little belt or something they could strap on. Then, it, you know, then the cross piece you could use for other figures if you need to. Alrighty. Now I don't have his green helmet, and well, he is. Rapid fire is not in the greatest condition, but again, he's just like a almost basically like the super trooper <laughs> but green so the super trooper helmet fits on him perfectly <laughs> he wasn't thick in the crotch bro <sighs> his crotch is broken then we have free fall I have two of them and you can actually use the uh, rubber mask around his helmet as well that uh, the other figures have like ripcord so that one he's got a pretty cool weapon and again I don't have all the weapons for the figures some I may or may not have anyone wants to donate any weapons feel free to and we have salvo I do have his helmet somewhere in the room and he does have a, a weapon I do have his weapon somewhere <laughs> oh, never prepared for these reviews because I don't get a lot of time with the four girls that I have. <laughs> uh, next, we have Stretcher. Now it looks like he has this little uh, medical device. He just gives people shots. <laughs> so I gave him this cool weapon. And he does come with something else. Uh, the weirdest looking thing. <laughs> it's got some skis. Probably on the shelf. I'll have to take a look. I seen it earlier. But, oh well. It's around. I thought I put it over here. But, oh well. Alrighty. Then we have Tapsad. He's a navy guy. You know, they didn't paint his eyeballs. <laughs> so, again, how's we're just getting lazy there? Let me just move some of these figures back. 
then we have this guy looks pretty awesome I do have two of these guys and that is the laser viper <laughs> not only does he have lasers he gets to hold a laser <laughs> see now he should have had a type of jetpack with his lasers that would have been cooler alrighty next we have range viper and you'll see in the background there I have a few because they s kind of confuse it but we'll have to go through it when we do the uh, action figure comparisons so this one is range viper now this guy almost looks like the immortals they got the cool masks some of them have a skeleton masks so they look pretty friggin awesome then we have Metalhead. There's Metalhead. Now, I keep trying to find more Metalheads, but again, you know, the Iron Grenader's head actually works well with this chest piece if you ever need to uh, create a different figure. But these little tabs always break off on his legs. Though I do have the other missile component that he has, but again, it just keeps breaking off. And now, we're gonna over to the rock viper you know not like the pet rock he is the rock <laughs> not like the wrestler the rock <laughs> although they should have made the rock figure well I think they might have but not in the o-ringer o-ring figure fashion and now undertow destro's viper or destro's water guy I don't have his mask I do know where I can get another one, but then I'd have to buy a lot for 200 and didn't have all G.I. Joe figures in that lot, so I was like, hmm, gonna have to wait on that one. Now we have Saw Viper. The colors for this one don't really go well. I mean, they should have did something better for the legs. You know, it just kind of doesn't look right. <laughs> He's not right in the head. It looks a little unproportioned. And, well, I do have a few figures for the Sky Patrol. So we're just going to put these Cobras back. And we're going to bring out a few figures. I'm missing two of the figures. I'm missing Airborne and Skydive. But we'll have a look after. Now, this one here is Airwave. Airwave has the Motor Viper body. And then we have, I don't have all their helmets or weapons, which kind of sucks because they have some pretty cool helmets. And well, this one here is Altitude. Let's get some altitude on these. <laughs> and then this one has the Strato Viper's body. <clears throat> and this here is Drap Zone. Now that is a cool name. Let's see how well I can zoom in on that drop zone and then we also have static line now I had two but someone else needed one so I just gave it well sold it to him for dirt cheap <laughs> sometimes I get rid of a few of my triples if I want to buy some other GI Joes but static line's got a cool haircut he's got a flat top See, now why didn't they make a figure named Flat Top? Hard Top? Flat Top? <laughs> high Tower? How come they didn't main, name anyone High Tower? You know? From the Police Academy movies. <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, those are four out of the six that I do have. And the ones I am missing. Let's have a look here. I am missing... Night Creep, or Night Creeper, that's right there, I don't know how well that'll come in, and I am missing, we'll go with this one here first, Airborne, that's another version of Airborne, oh, then I am missing this one here, Major Storm, Major Storm, alright, 
and I'm missing well this is the hammerhead driver so this is the decimator then there's major storm I don't have overlord it's from the cartoon probably most of these are from the cartoon I don't have updraft and what's the next version going to be downdraft slightly chilly <laughs> they're just Anyways, and we have Vapor. I don't have Vapor. He looks like a kind of, kind of a robot type guy. So I'm missing 8 out of the 30 figures. And it's not bad. There's not as many figures for that year. Whereas other years have like 48 figures and I'm usually missing 8. <laughs> 8 missing 8. Now someone corrected me on something in one of my videos. And I like to stand corrected. Now if I didn't have the vehicle oh, gun... I had it upside down and that's kind of funny but we don't edit the videos so see it actually sits in here perfectly so we got it in the right position finally <laughs> but again you know I was planning on picking up another one so we might do a future video of that vehicle once again and I did want to share with you that I picked up some stickers so eventually, if I ever get time, I'm going to paint up a few more vehicles. And just to give you an idea, now, Action Man figures work perfectly. Like, this will be from my MPs. And then, you know, Action Man, if you want some extra decals for stuff. I like stuff. Or radar stations and whatever for custom vehicles. And we got some communist red stars. You know, you used to be able to find these stickers in the stores pretty easily, but you can't now. I don't know, not here anyways. We got some red stars for communist vehicles. And some more action man. These ones are on some of my customs already. It's hard to tell. Depends on who makes them. Some people make better ones. This one's a smaller version. But you get a bunch of nice stars for the American vehicles and well you can't see the big star I don't know how to put that on aircraft carrier <laughs> but again you know some for the lights or whatever spotlights whatever you want to put them on so those are just some of the stickers or decals that I got or decals and again I was planning on getting a few more of these helmets but it is pricey when you order so much so we get some more communist helmets for our communist little army and I'd also like to point out if the uh, Russians are planning to use uh, their jets right away you think you might want a triple or you know times six the amount of uh, surface to air missiles you're gonna have there you know your Patriot systems and all that as well as some extra drones just floating around in the air uh, just to take out some of those jets so anyways uh, I hope you enjoy the videos and we do have more videos to come but again with the little ones you know I never get time to do as much and just to give you a preview of some of these guys here look at that they, these are cool it's like a skeleton face you know we'll go through the years as well as a custom one Again, that's the Cobra Commander's body from 89. You can just put one of these heads on. And it's a perfect fit. So, he matches the Immortal God, I think it is. Alrighty. Thanks for watching, and remember to keep on collecting and the war in the Ukraine is...